Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your girl Karabo. Thank you so much for tuning in to watch yet another video. Yo, I literally already had an intro for this Alaskan vlog. Even before I went to Alaska, I had already... I or, oh, Okay, I am too excited. I cannot talk properly right now, but I had an intro ready for this video. But as I'm editing it and about to like publish it, I'm just like, I need to like film an intro for this because we reached a thousand subscribers. How is that possible? Like, tell me how that is possible. I cannot believe it right now. Like, you guys did it. Like, we did it, Joe. <laughs> we did it. Thank you guys so much, guys. Like, I'm so thankful for each and every one of you that, like, shares my content, watches my content. To you guys, like, my Instagram followers, my day ones, you guys are the reason why I started this YouTube channel. I wouldn't have started it, but, like, you guys wanted it and you were very patient with it and i just want to say thank you so much like i read your comments i read your dms and you know i just i i, I don't know what to say i'm shook i don't know what to say i'm just excited and even though i look crusty right now i just i just wanted to give you guys my authentic self without makeup and all to say thank you <laughs> So thank you guys so much. Before you guys watch this, I just quickly wanted to explain myself because wow, guys, like <laughs> this trip was too much. <laughs> I don't know what happened in Alaska. I don't know what was going on, but like my speaker, first of all, only when I get home, I'm realizing that the wind is just, ooh, way too kingy. So I had to cut so many things because you can't hear properly. I can't let you guys watch something and then you can't hear. So I had to cut cut a bunch of stuff out and there's nothing to do in alaska there's nothing to do in alaska but we figured some things out and the things we wanted to do either didn't work out just watch the video <laughs> but anyway yeah that's it so i hope you guys um enjoy this video and hopefully one day we can really go back to alaska and redo everything that was meant to happen one day Maybe in 20 years, but one day. <laughs> I'm in my traveling history, I've showered before going, no, before sleeping and waking up to go to the airport and I have my outfit on already. <laughs> Um, there's two hours left until we have to wake up and I don't even think I'm going to sleep but at least I'm showered, my face is fresh, I brushed my teeth so literally I'm just going to wake up, drag my suitcases and go. I even have my jewelry on like guys, like that's how deep it is. Um, I don't want to do anything when I wake up. So that's it and hopefully alaska treats us well so see you there we are in seattle about to take off to anchorage and it's going to be like a three and a half hour flight i feel so sick guys like i'm definitely not feeling my best um it's just such a wrong way to start a trip especially going to alaska because i'm going to need all the energy i can get but i feel so horrible right now my body is just like shutting down but um let's hope i do get better but i'm very 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 exhausted <laughs> like i am so tired i'm only like running on like half an hour of sleep um but yeah i'll see you guys when i get to um or when we get to Encarage. So we just touched down Alaska, baby! We made it! We made it! Guys, there's nobody at the airport. It is like 1 p.m. in the afternoon. <laughs> nobody is here like it's a nice <laughs> airport though it is and it's a tiny just, tiny nice airport just no one's here yeah just nobody's here and it's like broad daylight so <laughs> so we made it 
Um, it is not that cold actually. No, I it's... feel like coming from Denver, Denver's I expected colder. yeah, Denver is very cold. And so um, the weather right now, like we haven't really been out out, but like I think I'm um, going to the parking lot. We would have figured out if it is freezing or not. And it's just like normal cold weather. It's cold, but like I thought it would be like a negative hundred or something. <laughs> <laughs> like I overpacked so many thermal underwear. Yeah, we like... definitely went out shopping specifically for the cold, and it's oh actually cooler. My God. Yeah, it's colder in Denver. And but we knew that coming, but yeah, we just didn't expect it. Like, yeah, no, I was honestly like, maybe they're just trying to throw us off. Like, yes, it is cold in Denver, but like, Alaska is Alaska. Like, maybe they like... The ocean's frozen. I know, the ocean is literally frozen, but like, it's not that bad. Anyway, right now we are on our way to um, Arctic Valley, and it is a snow tubing ski area. So we're going to go do some snow tubing and then when we're done with that go check in the hotel to warm ourselves up because it's going to be cold I think. <laughs> Three times. <laughs> <laughs> they just called this saying our hotel room is ready. So right now we're actually going to go to the hotel to change and then go snow tubing. But um, I figured we need to go to this um, mural that says like greetings from Alaska. Just so we get it out of the way. And you know me, I definitely want a picture there because was I in Alaska if I didn't take a picture there? <laughs> okay, so we made it guys. It's literally not such a big deal. Like, look at it. <laughs> I like things though, hey? Wow. Hi, Alaska. Okay. Got what I came here for, so. What does um, use? <laughs> so, since you guys gave me like 3K views on my apartment tour, maybe like a hotel tour is going to work as well. <laughs> Please give me those 3K views here as well. But. Let me show you guys my... <laughs> the one glove. <laughs> my apartment. So this is the bathroom. It looks freshly cleaned, which is a good thing. But this is it. And the bathtub is... Simple. It's just one string of hair. Guys, I literally like look at the smallest things. But that's done. And then we have our coat. Oh my goodness. There's like a whole sink area over here. Okay, well, I guess I should have gotten brought my face. What is it? Makeup. Skincare routine. But yeah, this is it. And I guess you have like a little nice desk area over here. And then this is the bed. It's a little small. What is it? It's a double bed. I don't even think it's a queen bed, right? <laughs> and then we have a bigger table than. I know. I don't know why we need it. It's a dining table. Wait, there's another door over there. Up oh, another room. So lock that. And then we have the TV, the living room area over here, and a nice fireplace. Oh, this is so cute. It's such a commercial feel. <laughs> I know. Yeah, that is the hotel tour. <laughs> right now, we are actually going to go to um, a snow tubing, a ski resort, but for snow tubing. So we're quickly going to change into our snow gear and then go have fun. So let's do it. So we on our way up. Um, they actually closed the ski resort road, and um, we just called and they said they closed it for today because the roads are bad. And we just looked up things to do in Alaska. And, I mean, not in Alaska, in Anchorage. And Everything's two hours away. Everything is like two hours away, one and a half flights. hour away. And um, I think I'm just gonna go back to the hotel and sleep, to be honest. I'd rather take this chance to sleep than do anything, to be honest. But yeah, that's the update. That sucks, but hopefully we find a snow tubing place in Fairbanks. Hey guys! Oh guys. <laughs> Bradley just said it sounds like I'm crying for help because I said, Hey guys! 
Anyway, we are live and kicking. <laughs> um, we went back to the hotel to sleep actually. So we spent our first day in Anchorage sleeping because snow tubing was closed. We tried. We tried and we failed, but it's okay. Everything we got some rest. Yeah, <laughs> we needed that one hour of sleep um, because we are running on like, oh my goodness, it's like crazy on a few hours of sleep. But we just woke up, um, which is a miracle because. How did that happen? Um, we are on our way to dinner and we're going to the crow's nest. Um, yeah, it's guys, I looked for nice restaurants in Alaska and this was the nicest. So be prepared. Be prepared. I don't know if to be disappointed or not, Probably but like level. <laughs> we'll find out where crow's yeah. nest is. Oh my goodness, like my level of like it's just it was the best I could find, literally, like it is the best restaurant in Anchorage. We are out here on the Malaskan streets. We out there. We are out there on them streets. But um, it's actually not cold. Not cold yet. It's getting colder. Is it? Yeah. Okay, I'm wearing my puffy jacket, so I don't know. I think you. Oh, so it does smell pretty bomb. It so good. Is it here? I think this is it. It's like a ship. A ship? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what a crow's nest is. So we just arrived at dinner. What do you think? It's nice. Definitely. It Look at this. Under height. Right? Yeah. It is beautiful. Ooh, look at Mr. Evanson wearing my favorite cutter shirt. Ooh, ooh cutie. <laughs> <laughs> look at this, Cheers. guys. Ooh. Oh, oh my goodness. Cheers. Oh, you got a nice big one. I know. Mm. Oh, you guys. Oh, my goodness. We out here living our best mm, lives. Mm, mm. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Leah. You guys, there's a Miss America pageant being held at the hotel that we just came from. And this lady started like asking people, like, is she part of the Miss America? Is she part of it? Like, are you? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, me? She's like, yeah, you're part of Miss America. I was like, I wish. Me? She's like, if you're not, you should be. So. Yeah. So you guys, I could just enter right now and say, I'm representing Florida. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, just got done with dinner. It was actually so good, guys. We are so stuffed, and our waiter was like the best. I don't even know her name. I think it was Tanya. I would recommend her. Tanya? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> Where did you see Tanya from? I just On have Tanya in my receipt? head. No, just Tanya oh in my, my head. <laughs> but um, she's amazing. If you go to the crowd's nest, she's a blonde lady. I think she's the only <laughs> blonde lady. Yeah. <laughs> but going back to the hotel now, and I am sleep, tired. Sleep, 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 sleep. Yeah, we're going to sleep. It's so crazy, you guys. We left the fireplace not you me bradley left the fireplace running and we just came back to our hotel and it literally feels like we are in miami i kid you not it is burning in here and we just called the front desk and this guy came up here like he was going to do something that we already haven't done bradley already opened the windows and stuff and he basically just came here and checked if the windows were open and he just told us to leave our front door open and that was his best he could have just told us that over the phone yeah why did he have to come all the way here but i am exhausted so i'm going to go take a shower right now and get to bed as soon as i'm done packing because we have a flight to catch at six in the morning so we have to be there at 4 a.m and it is not like 11 p.m so Good morning, y'all. It is 6 a.m. We are at the airport and we are on our way to Fairbanks. I am so exhausted, but just trying to 
get some breakfast going, even though cinnamon bun doesn't really count as a breakfast <laughs> meal. It's a dessert. But but it's a dessert, but um, it works for me. I've got my orange juice so I can get my vitamins in. And yeah. Fairbanks, guys. It's it, extreme. <laughs> it's definitely extreme. Guys, it looks cold outside. Like, oh my goodness. Let me go show you guys quickly. Can you please mind my bag? Look at this. Oh my goodness. Oh, it looks like it's, it's more freezing. intimidating in person than the video will show but yeah no it's like really crazy if you guys see it in person we landed in on the snow, snow. and like ice on the, the runway, runway yeah. ice and snow i've never seen that happen before because normally they clear out the runway but like in fairbanks it's literally on snow and it's so normal like they just were so casual but i know it's so normal <laughs> so it must not be that bad for fairbanks <laughs> standards but to us this is just i know so we are currently waiting for a cab there are no ubers no uber did you try lyft if they even have lyft yeah anyway we are waiting for a rental taxi wait no, taxi we're cab. just waiting for a taxi um, I haven't been in a taxi in the United States, period. <laughs> and this is not going to be a good experience for her seeing what the picture looks like, so... I, I've just never been inside a taxi, so it'll be interesting. But yeah, we are getting a taxi to go to our Turo car. Wait till you guys see this car. I'll Ooh, talk to you guys when we get fancy. there. Fancy! <laughs> really rough in an airplane. I'm sure a smaller one too, probably. Yeah, they use a caravan here. Do you love living in Alaska? I love it here. You love it? Oh wow. Have you ever thought about moving? Have I ever been what? Have you ever thought about moving? My wife and I thought about selling our home and moving about 10 years ago. Where to? We were going to go, I don't know, Colorado. No, my goodness. We Everyone are from Colorado. So, yeah. Okay. Yo. This is our rental car, so <laughs> do you guys like it? Okay. No. So we are thinking of going to the China Hot Springs right now, just driving there and getting it over and done with. The China Hot Springs are an hour away, no, an hour out from Fairbanks. So we are literally going to risk our lives right now and drive an hour out on snowy, icy roads. And yeah, let's see. Let's see how far we get. <laughs> The moment of truth! The moment of truth! <laughs> the moment of truth! Yep. Oh yeah. No. <laughs> We made it to the China Hot Springs, the famous hot springs. It's beautiful, you guys, and it's actually not as cold as people described it. People I think people were so extreme with this, but yeah, they said um, your hair is going to freeze, which I honestly I think that's what I I wanted that freeze, um, that hair frozen experience. But I think it's like later on at night, you know, like in the evenings as when it gets cold. Yeah, when it gets colder, but. It's gorgeous as you guys Perfect can see. temperature too. Perfect temperature. Oh. It's definitely not like the Denver one. We just got done with the hot springs. Don't mind the towel guys. My hair was frozen. 
frozen. They're frozen, frozen. <laughs> With a capital I was F. Elsa, <laughs> you guys. It is very frozen. So right now we're trying to see if we can get access to the ice museum. Ice museum. Apparently they serve you drinks with like ice glasses. Yeah, apple martini and an ice uh, martini glass. So <laughs> <laughs> on our way to the ice museum, we're going to have martini glasses in an ice glass. <laughs> 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 but um excited 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 to see the ice museum it looks like an eskimo's house like an igloo is what they call it actually <laughs> Is it cold? No. It's not as bad as outside just because of the I know. Outside is cold, inside is actually warm. But everything is made of so snow. I don't know if we'll be in here later today, but if you hear like a dentist drill going on, that's it. Right here won second place, I think in 1998. Um, but the original was about three stories tall. I think that's so big. Can you give me a mansion here? Antler hide and a bucket. Bring your own bucket, actually. Would you? It's my temperature that I like. Oh my god, it is. <laughs> <laughs> How do they make these glasses? Um, he makes them right up there, but I don't know. I guess he's not doing them today. Oh, okay. Yeah. Do you have a lot? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Put your hand in there. Oh, you don't have to put that much vodka in mine. <laughs> you got your triple shot. <laughs> yep. <laughs> she took a care of us. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. What do they tell us to do? <laughs> Inside your head, though. Inside your oh, yeah. I cannot tell you guys what I'm wishing for. Here. No, I'm starting all over. Here. I wonder if she'll go. Oh. When alcohol hits you, it's awesome. I wish. Oh, fuck. How do you feel about it? I know. Oh, oh. Our meat apple martini hit differently. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to run and get the car? Oh, okay then. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> so we just came back from the hot springs. It was a very long drive, guys. But we just checked in our hotel. Let me give you guys a quick tour. That is the kitchen and then over here you have a mirror which I obviously love because duh and then you have the bathroom in here very clean which I like so a plus for that and then you have this desk area here we have a TV and then this is the bed then we have Bradley there sitting on the recliner and that is it you guys 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 I just met Change South Africans <laughs> <laughs> say hi hey Jumelan Jumelan Sanwanani Ninjani Ninjani I'm so excited what are the odds of coming to Alaska yeah, and meeting South nice. Africans uh, you know what this um, I'm taking my son he's 17 for father son you know the closer oh. people have oh, of course you need to yeah so this is uh, our journey oh this is your journey we went all the way to the arctic circle really yeah where are you guys living was right it now? long we're living in massachusetts <laughs> no, okay really yeah. we were 
So you guys, this literally is so like is one of the best starts to dinner. Oh yeah, definitely. Like so, the restaurant looks like that. It is very nice. It is very clean. And we've been talking to our South African friends for like half an hour. <laughs> we didn't even order yet. Like, and we've just been like rambling, guys. They are from um, Limpopo. But um, they live in Massachusetts, so it's like, guys, I'm just like, we're talking everything South African, so. Keep on hearing about high standards, and it is consistently the same story. Keep telling Bradley the South same African story. What is this? Like, like hospitality. Okay, our restaurants, hotels. Cleanliness, standards, standards, food, just all top notch. Perfect. And we just had two more. And they just oh, confirmed yeah. that for me, so... And they said it before we brought it up. Oh yeah, no, it's just, oh my goodness, guys. But it's like amazing, we made new friends. Hopefully you will get to go to Massachusetts and visit. Um, but yeah, it's very exciting. I and like this restaurant, like, the food looks bomb. Bomb. Like, the food really looks so good. So we got three main courses. We got, three, we got pork, we got a steak, and we got a halibut. So... I can't wait. I can't wait. It smells so good. So this is the owner hey of the restaurant. Say hi. Are you? <laughs> I'm so glad I came here. But I'm, I'm so, so excited to, to try you. your food. Oh yeah, I'm so excited to have you. Yeah. So if you guys are in uh, Fairbanks, okay. make sure you come to Jazz Bistro. My and love to you. I promise it's amazing and yeah. it smells good. Even yeah, though I haven't eaten already. <laughs> Alright, sounds great. Well, <laughs> Thank <welcome> you. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys! Look at that. Oh, that is the appetizer, by the way. Can you guys see how tired I am? I'm so tired. It is almost 10.30 p.m. We are currently waiting for our um, pickup shuttle to take us to the Northern Lights. So it's going to be like a um, 45-minute drive. They're picking up everybody else right now, and they'll be here in a few minutes. But... I don't know how I'm going to make it throughout the night morning because I'm so tired right now. I'm glad so you we one. just got to our tour bus. There was no bus. wipes last night, everyone yeah, said. Yeah, so. Oh my goodness, I don't want to flush oh, everybody, man. but well, it at is 10.50 I mean, we can only go and from we here, are no right? way, so let's move out of this side. <laughs> so we just got to the viewing lodge. Somebody here is busy with these. My drone. With these drone. My drone. Trying to get us arrested here. Yeah. But and we're connected. Yeah, drinking hot cocoa. Yes. Just waiting for the lights, I guess. So we are flying the drone outside. And yes. I'm impressed. Okay, it actually goes really high. So and far. we have time tomorrow, and it is not crabby day and not snowing. But we are literally, oh my goodness, guys, is it this dark? It is that dark. Oh the my light God. is not even doing, like, the flashlight is not even doing anything. I do like this bright light, though, right now. It's hitting the angles right. Right? <laughs> we are waiting for. Okay, you can't see, but we are waiting for lights. <gasps> Aurora lights. It's actually not that cold outside, but also I'm wearing, like, thermal undergarments. We did it, we did it well. We did I'm it wearing, right. look yeah. at me. Look at me. Hold this. Let me show the people. Let's see the layers. I <laughs> the layers? I only have one. We came prepared, don't you? <laughs> oh yeah. I've never been this warm in my life. Trust me. Uh, who's from South Africa? You're from I South am. Africa? Which which part? Johannesburg. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Have you been? I've been to Cape Town, yes. Oh, I love Cape Town. It's beautiful. So Cape Town. The beach, the mountains. I love Cape Town. I love Cape Town too. You know, we, you know, if I ever go back. Here, let's turn the light off here. Port Elizabeth? Yeah, Port Elizabeth. Port Elizabeth, PE. Durban? 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 Yes. Oh, I love Durban. Guys, we've been here for like two hours now. It is one. Is it almost one? Yeah. It is like 10 minutes to one and. The lights are still not out, so 
it looks like it's a bust tonight um it doesn't look like they are going to come out it is very cloudy which is a bummer because like <laughs> i didn't plan on coming back to alaska and now it's just one of those things we're going to keep in the back burner like we need to go back to alaska to see the aurora light good morning oh there's so many things going on here let me turn this down for a bit so it doesn't make noise but this is our last day in alaska Someone's i'm excited. so excited <laughs> 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 even though denver and and um alaska are like this with like weather wise i am so excited to go back home no northern lights good way taking i'm so disappointed but it's fine it's another state to take off the bucket list we are currently at a drive through at a McDonald's drive through guys. If you go on vacation, make sure McDonald's is your best friend. <laughs> Instead of spending like a lot of money, we literally will go to a fancy dinner, I mm -hmm. think, once or twice. But like, that's about it. And if it doesn't meet our standards, we usually are, are defaulting to, we should have went to McDonald's, McDonald's for the value. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but anyway, we are going dark sledding. So it's a 30 minute drive. Um, it's going to be fun. That's like the one thing I'm actually excited for is dog sledding. And thank you. Thank you. Use your code. Thank you. Thank you so much. We'll see you guys when we get there. So, Peace. Jesus. Oh, that was good. <laughs> yeah. You guys, look at these cute doggies. Hey boy! So his, Hi. His they are so cute! I'm not a doggy person, but like, I can't help it. Look at them. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> look at them, they look happy. <laughs> yeah. Like, Can I go for a run? Can I? Oh, is that what he was barking for? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, exactly. They hyperactive dogs, aren't they? And it probably warms them up running. Hey! Yeah. Hey. <laughs> it's so cute seeing my butts. <laughs> it's a little thing for <laughs> when you see when they <laughs> talk, they'll snow bathe. Um too, they'll like flop over and start rolling in the snow and yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. I up. wish I had the athleticism tis. That's <laughs> insane. Just finished with dog sledding and now we smell like dog. It smells like straight dog in here. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> and you don't smell it out there. I think that's the part that we like enjoyed. Yeah, you don't the smell it out there. But now it's like on our clothes and stuff. But anyway, they were the cutest thing ever. Like those dogs. There's one called Woo Piggy. <laughs> <laughs> he just jumps on you and he wants attention. All he does is want love. I know. Wants to love and run. <laughs> now we're going to the North Pole. Woo, woo, woo. Let's go. Guess who made it to the North Pole? <laughs> and Hater said it's fake. <laughs> drop it, drop it low at the North Pole. <laughs> How south can you get at the North Pole? How south can you get at the North Pole? Hey, okay, she's gone crazy diving in snow. Oh my god, this is a you gotta close your arms more. What up? She's living her best life. I know, but you're still going to see it. <laughs> we are literally walking on a huge river right now. Like this whole area over here covered in snow is water. And I am freaking out because look at this. Let me show you how it's done. Here. Let me show it's done. Oh. <laughs> that 
That was painful, wasn't it? <laughs> so, today we are at Pikes Landing. It is 24 degrees cold. Um, Light the flurries. Temperatures from the, north. <laughs> the temperatures from the north are blowing in, causing the aurora lights to kind of swerve just slightly two inches down below the cloud surface. <laughs> now, let's get some warmth. <laughs> So what is going on here? So we just discovered that the Pikes Landing restaurant is closed, which means we're probably going to stop today for the evening. And freeze. So if these are my last words, I was in Alaska. I experienced love, life, fun and love. I lived, I loved, I well. And I laughed. <laughs> Bradley lost the car keys, guys. Oh my gosh, look at him. He lost them in the river. <laughs> wow, oh my, can't really imagine if the snow buried them. Okay, now we can officially get into the car. My lips are so ashy and dry guys. Woo, child, Alaska. Uh, we are currently on our way to a, a sculpture ice competition in Fairbanks and so it's just like people competing and like um, sculpting ice what? yeah it's a nice sculpting, competition ice sculpting um, but yeah that's what we are gonna do it's currently snowing outside as well it's like raining but snowing we just arrived at the ice sculpting museum in Fairbanks it looks awesome like look at this guys it is made out of ice isn't that crazy? I quickly want to go in it. You got your bum bum. Oh, yep. oh, look at the lights on the floor. Fun. It looks like that. Oh my god, look at this side. <gasps> oh, that's amazing. What is this? Oh, it's putt putt. No, this is putt putt. Isn't it yeah. mini golf? Okay, so you're at two. <laughs> Why are you outside? <laughs> Go! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Good. You're you're farther out. <laughs> That's in, no. <laughs> All right, another slide. <laughs> this is for like An eight to ten year olds, but this is so much fun. <laughs> she, Majesty, walks to her throne. <laughs> Can you imagine falling down? Oh yeah, I know. We're hitting our head off the ice. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. Look at that. You go down face first. On my tummy? Yep. Oh, he didn't make it. No, go down there. No, bottom. you go, yeah, go first. <laughs> you want me to go first? Yeah, because I want to see if you're going to make it or not. Ready? Three, this thing is two, scary. one. Oh, it is. It is so <laughs> she did it. Nice. Medic evacuation. Medic evacuation. Let's get her inside. She's in pain. Oh Am I heavy? No, it's so easy. Medic evacuation. <laughs> Look at that mouth. Look at the spikes, the teeth, and the tongue. Imagine if the tongue falls off. Somebody sculpted this of ice. Like, that is so crazy. 
Look at that, guys. Oh. Out of ice. Wait till you see the elephant behind you. First? Time to go. What did you think? It was also my fun. It kept you in the cold for this long, so it must have been somewhat fun. That's true. I didn't even like feel the cold um, at all, and I feel like it's tripping. Like <laughs> I just need a hot bath. <laughs> yes. You guys, I am so tired. Just finished. Not just. Yeah, I just finished taking a shower. Um, we came back from the ice. Ice, I keep saying ice museum. <laughs> Whose alarm is that? Do you have an alarm going off? But anyway, we came back from the ice competition sculpture thing, which was so cool. We had so much fun. It was so cool. And we felt like eight year olds again, just like using kids' lights. <laughs> but it was honestly so fun. People who do those sculptures are so talented. It's insane. Like, if only you guys saw them in real life. I don't know how I'm going to sound right now. Bradley broke my speaker. My <laughs> <Put it on. laughs> But yeah, we are just about to have dinner. We actually went to a restaurant and we ordered some food, came back to the hotel, took showers, we are done packing up and we are about to have some dinner and then in two hours time we are going to head to the airport because it is time to get back to real life. It is time to go back to work. It is time to get enough money for the next vacation. <laughs> But um, anyway, yeah, we're going to eat and then that's it. That's literally the end of our vacation, Alaska. And I don't think I'm going to vlog going back home, like the airports and stuff. I don't like vlogging going back home because it's depressing. And tiring. And tiring. <laughs> it's like you get what you get. Like, <laughs> so I will see you guys next Sunday and hope you enjoyed the vlog. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. So, peace out.